Okay, so I'm very happy to see so many beautiful, smiling faces in the children. I had dinner with them tonight. It's fantastic dinner. I really enjoy it. And also sitting with them is the most refreshing thing that a human being can have. And sometimes, personally, I, I forget about I forget about that. Now that I forget to, I live in another world, so to speak. And it was very refreshing to sit with them and to see how beautiful, how joyful, full of life, full of everything. And I said, well, if they grow up that way, and they're different countries, different nationalities, different colors, different everything, they sit together, they, they, they don't know about this balloon they put in their own hands. And why should we do that? Why do we do that? Why do we do that? Imagine that all the world would be like, like they are right now. Would it be a golden age? Isn't that, The moment, the moment we grow up, then we say, oh, this is the nationality, this is your country, this is your language, this is that, 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 this is your flag. We kill them. We kill them, literally, literally. All the creativity, all the beauty, natural beauty, that's why children are so attractive, the natural beauty, natural love, is spontaneous. But on the way to the forum, what's happened to all that? And that's thanks to what? To our societies. Parents, of course, are part of societies. But the parents should learn a little bit how to instill them brotherhood in a true sense. Love, understanding, tolerance, compassion to one another. Then we can really, really aspire for a golden age. If you imagine the children who go to a school and maintain the same beautiful spirit they have now, and pass it on to their children and grandchildren. How long will it take to have a golden age on this planet? By the name of civilization, the name of this and the name of that, we kill each other, starting with whom? The most beautiful flowers that the earth has, children, the future of humanity. So it's important, and somebody started this mission, and some of the folks have a grand vision. These are the future generations. And at least to have the seeds in their own mind. What it means working together, studying together, playing together, eating together, beyond all sort of barriers. Okay? So beautiful photo of Swami Vishnu having a, a world, uh, what do you call it, globe, and embracing to say, I love everybody. Starting with them, the children. That's the most beautiful thing we have on earth. The beauty of the children, the beauty of the humanity, that constantly recreate itself, constantly comes out like a beautiful flower in the spring. We have to be careful to maintain it. Because if we don't, then karma will kick back on us. Karma will 